Hey guys, are you looking at installing an LED light bar on your vehicle, but you don't have a bull bar? Well, let me show you how to install the Adventure King's LED number plate bar on my vehicle. Let's go. All right, first things first, the tools that you will need. So basically you can start off with a complete socket set that will help you to install the light bar. And um, with the wiring harness, you just need another basic tool set just to get you going. Um, but yeah, for today I'm obviously going to use my power tool just to make things quicker because um, you know you don't want to spend hours on a thing that you can spend 10 minutes. So yeah, let's get into it. I'll tell you what, these hyperlapse videos make it look way quicker than it really is. <laughs> but anyway, let me show you exactly what I've done. So what you want to do is you want to lay all your cables where it needs to go. So I've mounted the fuse box over there and then I've already inserted everything into the stick pipe. Um, so basically the one goes to your battery. So that will be uh, obviously your positive and your negative. And then the other one is this one. So that goes to your headlights. So it actually plugs into your headlights. Um, it is universal, so it should fit your vehicle. And that will make sure when you turn on your headlights that that one will turn on as well, um, your high beam. And then the other one went this way. You have to find a grommet for your vehicle. Um, so this way. Yeah, of course the pipe's in the way. Um, but yeah, basically find a grommet for this big pipe to go through um, so you can mount the switch on the inside. But then there's another cable, so this one. I've let it through right here. Well, there's my mic, that's just great. And then it just goes through in there. And that one connects to your light bar. So it's just in there. There you go just still have to fix that up um, but you know that's how it sits over there and then on the inside I'll show you on this side first well that's not gonna work I'll have to get me light all right let's try again shall we I got a light um, so let me show you what I've done all right so down here, um, as you can see, the cables comes through the grommet, um, so it actually goes that way. It's this one over here. I've just cable tied it as well, and then you need to lead it through to the other side. Okay. So what I've done is I've uh, where is it? Connected it to the top. Let me get my phone in there. So there's the cable. Just comes this way. Over here, that one. So let's get some light. All right. So that's the cables, and then that's the one that goes to your switch. So it comes with this thing. Um, you just have to make a hole, and then you just bang slap that in there and then you can turn it on or off which is pretty cool so you're not going to lose your high beams um, 
you can still use your normal high beams or you can switch that one on and the light bar will go on so it won't be constantly on um, but yeah and pretty much oh the last thing uh, was to mount this one so obviously it's just two nuts uh, not nuts screws over there and um, make sure that's nice and tight it's the exact same size as your number plate which is pretty cool um, but yeah that's me light bar and then I'll show you some shots at night Well, there you go, guys. Yeah, I'm holding a microphone, but you know, it's all good. Um, but yeah, what do you reckon? You guys seen the footage? I reckon it's pretty good. It's all you need, really. Um, I bought this one because it's easy to install. It took me about an hour to do so. It provides enough light to watch out for kangaroos jumping out on the side of the roads at night. Um, so I definitely rate it. Also, if you're wondering about costs, they are about $64 um, at Adventure Kings with the wiring harness. So this one plus the wiring harness, $64, which is not too bad. And also, if you're not in the area, you can always have a look on eBay. They will definitely have similar options as well. So don't worry about that. But yeah, that's it for this week. Make sure to stay tuned for next week. I'm almost done with exams, so then I'll finally make more exciting videos, such as going to Glasshouse Mountains and doing awesome trips. So yeah, I'm looking forward to it. What do you reckon? Do you like this light bar? And if you have any questions, make sure to drop down in the comments. If you don't mind, please give me a subscribe. Give us a like as well. That would really help the channel. Um, but yeah, if you have any questions, just reach out and I'll get back to you. For now, have a good one, and I'll see you next week. See ya.